Present of the horses now for race number three this evening's third, pacing stallions and geldings, racing one mile. Number one is KF Noble, owned by Henry Kaufman of Baltimore, Brad Hanners drives. Number two, Midnight Baker, laced by Clarence and Sean Mayhew of Canal Winchester, Sean Mayhew up. Three is Menagerie, owned by the Lentford stable of Lebanon with Eric Lentford. Number four, Moonlight Tim, owned by J.D. Burnett and the Arnold Saban estate of Wilmington, Chip Noble drives. Five is Scratch, number six, Best is Fran, owned by Lore and Paul Baker of Galloway, Leslie Turcott driving. Number seven, HR Sculptured, owned by the Minor League Stable of Wapakoneta with Mike Wilder. Number eight, Reckless Decision, owned by Rick Guerin of Germantown, Rick Guerin drives. Number nine, Skiff, owned by the Hall Investment Company of Logan, Dave Myers, in the Sulky. Stallions and Gildings are running behind the gate. They swing to the back stretch, and there they go. Off stride, the one KF Noble. And they're off. Moonlight Tim is first to fire from the center off the track. Midnight Baker alongside is away second. Early third is Menagerie. From the outside fourth comes Bestest Friend. Down low, racing five, HR Sculptured, recovering quickly. Sixth was KF Noble. For the inside, a seventh comes Reckless Decision. The early trailer eighth, it's Skiff. They were the first quarter mile marker, and Moonlight Tim is handling this field easily early as he reaches that first quarter 27 and 1, and Moonlight Tim is wasting no time here this evening. He's opened up by 15, 20 likes inside a second to Midnight Baker. Out of the outside, a three. As they come to the stretch, as HR Sculptured, between horses, a fourth, it's Menagerie. To the outside five comes KF Noble. Down low, sixth, it's Bestest Friend. And it's a gap of seven lengths to skiff the trailer now. His reckless decision, they reach the half, 55 and two, and Moonlight Tim, cruising along at a comfortable pace, looking very handy this evening. Off that winning qualifier, has a lead. Far back second to Midnight Baker to the outside third. It's HR Sculptured. Racing fourth with cover the outside. It's KF Noble alongside racing at five. Comes Menagerie nearing the three quarters. And Moonlight Tim continues to dominate here this evening. Three quarters, 125 and two. And Moonlight Tim and a stakes prepper here tonight. Showing the way has showed the entire mile. Midnight Baker inside his second. HR Sculpture to the outside is third, and now to the outside fourth comes Menagerie as they turn for home. Only question is how fast this evening in his second career start, second seasonal start, it's all Moonlight Tim to the outside, now closing nicely three comes Menagerie, but it's Moonlight Tim, gate to wire night in 156. Menagerie gets up for second, that's his friend third. Third race now official. For three perfect, it pays thirty-two dollars sixty cents, thirty-two sixty. The uh, trifecta for three six, paying four hundred sixty-four dollars even for sixty-four. Trackside the winner this evening's third race, gate to wire for number four, Moonlight Timmy, three-year-old Kentucky Brenson of Falcon Sealster from Moonlight and by Falcon Elmerhurst. He's a homebred owned by J.D. Burnett of the Arnold Saban Estate of Wilmington, Ohio. Chip Noble trains and drives his first lifetime win this evening. Earning a mark of 156 flats.